Moin Moin and welcome to another video. So I'm pretty sure some of you guys might recognize this game called Transport Fever 2. I certainly do because it's my second favorite game and with the 250.5 hours I've spent in this game it's also my second most played game. And with this many hours I've spent in this game, you might think I've done everything this game has to offer. Oh, but you'd be wrong. You'd be so wrong. Because you see, there's one thing I haven't done. And that's the campaign mode. So, welcome to my let's play of the Transport Fever 2 campaign mode. Oh, and also, before we start, this is the third time I've recorded the intro. And I'm sorry, but the music in the video is gonna get really loud. Um, I'm, I'll try to fix this in the next videos. Okay, so we should probably start in chapter one. Mankind is constantly creating amazing new inventions. Get involved in rapid technology progression and ensure smoothly running transportation in different regions of the world. Got it. So, there are some regions. I don't know where we sh should start. I guess we're just gonna play all of them. Um, oh, and also, before this video really starts, um, I just want to say, Urban Games, if you watch this video and I'm not supposed to use your audio, please comment down below because I've searched on the internet if I am allowed to use the soundtrack for my gameplay videos and I've only found out that you can, um, that you're allowed to do this in Transport Fever 1. Um, so I assumed you're also allowed to do it in Transport Fever 2. But the soundtrack is... The soundtrack is booming. It's pretty cool. So anyways, let's start. Um, do you want to start up here? Or... You can also see I have actually played a little bit of it. But not that much. This is like the only thing I've ever played. I haven't played this, I haven't played this, this, this or this. This is like the only thing I've begun to play, but yeah, I haven't played it really far. So anyways, let's restart and yeah. I like this little train whistle. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Okay, we'll see us again when this loading screen is done. Um, welcome to Uncharted Territory, newcomer. Want to get rich? Yeah. I bet I do. Then you're in just the right place. Yes! Gold Rush Fever holds sway in Virginia. <laughs> Country roads. And you, you lucky devil, you've won the mining rights for a promising claim in a poker game at the Red Dog Saloon. Soon you'll be hauling out gold nuggets as big as a cat's head. That's not very big, but yeah. Mission Mining Miracle. Searching for the shaft, thanks, oh, thanks to the cleverness and lucky luck, luck at cards, you have a gold mine all your own. The former owner, a gal at the saloon by the name of Susie, who plays a Lousy hand of poker already took care of the groundwork and a practical woman she left the necessary equipment behind too. 
Now all you have to do is mine. Bonus tasks. I haven't. I don't have bonus tasks yet. Okay, continue. Move. Okay, yeah, this is like kind of a tutorial. Um, I've only already done all this stuff. So, oh uh, yeah. <laughs> and move the camera for 500 meters. Okay, finding the mine. It's right here. Virginia gold mine. Task completed. Stability in the mining galleries. What a promising claim. Even though only a few boulders have been mined so far, that's not a re <laughs> Okay, I'm bad at reading. You'll just have to dig deeper. I'm an expert at digging. Uh, build a truck stop. Yep, so... We're, we're just going to go through this little tutorial very quick because I already know all the essentials. Now we, now we have to build a truck depot. Or, no, we first have to do a line. Let's call this the... Here, country roads line. Because, I don't know. <laughs> I like country roads. Um, then now the depot. And now let's buy some vehicles. H how many do I have to buy? I only have to buy one. Let's go with three because three dep uh, not three depots. Three um, horses can get me more money. Yeah, country roads line. And right now we'll just have to wait. So if we click this four times button, then they'll start moving faster. And well, first we have to deliver logs. So, still no bonus tests. Yeah. We'll just have to wait a little. Can we just say... Like... Like, can we just say this game has beautiful music? Like, I've never heard this music before because... I wasn't in the campaign and when I was in the campaign I... Haven't really listened to the music but... Like, the music of this game is beautiful. Uh, yeah. Well, huh. Not everything that glitters is gold. Maybe your poker partner was sharper than you thought. Despite all the hardship, the mine only brings uh, in a few chunks of silver ore. At best, you out to get rid of it before it ruins you. Luckily, uh... Ah, stop! Skipping stuff. So, you got rid of the silver mine for a decent amount. Time to invest this money in a... Uh, oh yeah, my account. Indeed. Got up. Wait, wait, let's... And there is an excellent opportunity. All the ore f from the mine must be transported to the silver mills down by the river. A railroad that takes over the transport would be a promising venture. Yeah, it would be. So... Let's go over to buildings, a cargo station, okay, 120 meters if you want it like that game. Track needs to be attached, yeah, I'm not a newcomer. And now I do believe we have to fix the track here, yeah. So just do this, do this even though it's slow, but like the trains in here aren't really fast and now a bridge yeah <laughs> this looks so 
dumb. Yeah, let's do a bridge. And now I only have to establish a line. Carson City. I think they wrote Carlson wrong. Carlson line. Do you know what Carlson is? <laughs> Carlson's a pretty cool game, isn't it? Uh, it would be cooler if it was out, but yeah. Danny has some problems with it, yeah. But you bet we're gonna let's play the game when it's out. So let's build a depot and let's connect the depot to the track. And now let's buy a vehicle. So connect the depot to existing track. Uh, buying a vehicle. Do we have any bonus hacks? No. Buying a vehicle. It's high time. Okay, we have we do have to have three gondolas. So three. Nah, let's add a fourth one. Not enough vehicles available at this time. Come on, game. Okay, let's just buy three. And let's run it on the Carlson line. And yeah. As you can see, the depot has no track, so I don't know how this train works, but it's using some kind of magic. And now we just have to deliver the silver ore. And for that, we're gonna hop on the train. See how this beautiful train delivers ore. Yeah, I don't see it too, because it hasn't gotten to the ore yet. But we can say the train looks pretty cool, so let's speed it up. And let's wait until it delivered the silver ore. Look at this beautiful landscape. Transport Fever is a pretty cool game. And... Yeah. Now it goes to Carson City. And there we are. Wasn't that a beautiful ride you didn't get to see? Yeah, I know. I know. Okay. Do we now have bonus tasks? Yes, the deed is done. The first train is rolling down the line. People are dropping everything to cheer your marvel of engineering. Don't pass up the chance to climb aboard and give him a friendly awake. Yeah, accept. Accept. Click on the train and use the cockpit. Didn't we just do this? Uh, okay. So we've just completed the bonus test. What? Activating. Find out about the needs of your future passengers. Activate the land use layer. Uh, is it this? Land use layer, yes. Okay. Build bus stops in each of the highlighted areas in Carson City. Okay. This is a stupid bus, like... Why the f... Why the f would you, like... Go from here to here with a bus? You, this is basically in walking distance. Um... What? What? Oh. Oh, but there is one. It's still in walking distance, but at least it now... Uh, well, established... Oh. Of course, I have to do a line first. Well, since I haven't added a second bus stop here, I can't do that. So, let's just call it the... Uh, Carson City commute, uh, com, 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 
commuter. There we go. And now let's build a depot. Where should we put this? Let's put it all the way out here. Buying and I'll, yeah. And now let's buy vehicles. Oh, I can't see anything. The horse drawn carriage. Let's buy three vehicles. Yeah, we have to have three vehicles. Those were four, but okay. Transport five passengers within Carson City. Yeah. So since we have the game on 4x speed, this shouldn't take that long. Oh, another bonus test. A beast is up to no good in the area. According to eyewitness, it leaped from tree to tree, was at least 10 feet tall, had a shaggy black pelt and enormous feet. Ask the reporter what it's all about. Yeah, except, of course. The reporter, a certain Mr. Clemens, has revealed this his source to you an old good for nothing by the name of Sam Hawkins. He's, su he's supposed to be in the saloon in Virginia City. Could be it means buying him a couple of shots of hard liquor before he comes up with the truth. Find the next clue. Well, that was easy. Following the clue. The good man was happy to provide information. The monster, uh, yeah. Um, find the next clue. Easy enough. Um, old card. Where? Well, yeah. Find the next clue. Sup? Just lose him. The wild man is dead. Okay, that's everything we had to hear. The wonder of Carson City, where not too long ago there was nothing more than a drear. Uh, I can't read that. The locals even call it the miracle of Carlson City. More and more people want to try their luck there. Obstacles shouldn't be put in the way. Ah! Build a passenger station in Carson City and connect it with the passenger station in Reno using tracks. Okay. Passenger station. Yeah. Sorry for one person that lived there, but your house now got destroyed. We had to make place for a train station. Oh, oh, it's already there. Okay. And now let's kind of wiggle the railroad around and there we go. Everything is set. Build a new depot near the line and trans. Buy another locomotive with three passenger carriages there. Okay, let's do it. Locomotive. Can we this time do four? Yes! Okay. And now let's get it on a line. I got four carriages. Uh, what? Mm. Carriages. Jealous. <laughs> I don't know if that's correct, but yeah. Okay, bring 20 people to Carson City, bring 20 people to Reno. Should be easy enough. Bonus task, yeah. Deliver more logs. He barely got away from the cart right boys. Now get a respectable load of logs down the valley as fast 
deliver logs from the ranch to the timber supply. Okay. Should be easy. Just put up a little here. And I think we're supposed to do it. No, this is furnace firing. Silver ore processing. It is there anything for this in Carson City or do we... Huh? Oh. Huh? Ah well. I don't care for this. Just give me some horse-strong carriages. Give me money! Exclamation marks. Okay. So it should work now. There are the trucks. Where? Where? Where's the train? Oh, there's the train. 24 people. Well, that was easy. Let's ride it. You know what I also like? I like how like the name of the line is showing up down here on the screen. I bet all those people that are driving with my train are jealous. Why did it only count as 17, huh? There were 27 passengers on the... Whatever. Guess I would have to wait anyway since... They are still in the uh, autosave. <laughs> well, let's ride with this one. See what he sees. Oh, yes. Wonderful. They're pretty slow right now, but like, it's also horses, so... The horses are now pretty fast. So this first episode might be a little bit boring because we're just doing some basic stuff, but I hope the story picks up at some point. This train still delivering silver. Can, can I now get more gondolas in? Because I think it needs it. Like, there's so much silver here, it's overloading. And the locks part should be done fairly soon. train thing should also be done soon. Everything is losing me money, no. Okay. Earn all medals in one of the submissions. What? It wasn't really hard, you know. Full steam ahead. Yeah. And now... Okay, I think we've completed the first mission and I think this is also the perfect time to cap this episode here. So remember, if you liked the video, give a like. If you love the video, then maybe subscribe. And if you didn't like the video, then give it a dislike, see if I care. And next time we're going to play this mission. Anyways, I hope you had fun. Goodbye.